Here's an interesting fact about Thor Ragnarok. Not only that Taika Waititi directed the movie and played the funny character Korg. I'm looking for Korg. Who's asking? Oh no, you're asking. Just, just, is there anyone else asking or is it just you? He also played one of the three heads of Haiju. He is this one. Did you know who played the head on the left? It's none other than Chris Hemsworth. Yeah, it's called the Re Revengers. Revengers? Because I'm getting revenge. You're getting revenge, and you're, do you, you, do you, what do you, you want revenge? I, um, I'm, I'm just undecided. Okay. Before the 2015 Netflix Daredevil series, there was a long forgotten Ben Affleck Daredevil movie back in 2003. Can you still remember who played Matt Murdock's lawyer partner, Foggy Nelson, in the movie? Jean Favreau. While working on the movie, the actor and director got interested in creating a superhero movie that's why he initiated the discussions with Marvel over what would eventually become the 2008 Iron Man. And of course, the rest is history. The truth is, I am Iron Man. Here is an interesting fact you probably didn't know about Spider-Man Homecoming. Peter Spider Suit's AI is voiced by Jennifer Connelly. Suit lady, where am I? You're in the most secure facility on the eastern seaboard. Who in real life is married to Paul Bettany, the voice of Jarvis, Iron Man's AI. Test complete, preparing to power down and begin diagnostics. Uh, yeah, tell you what, do a weather and ATC check, start listening in on ground control. Sir, there are still terabytes of calculations needed before an actual flight is a Jarvis, sometimes you gotta run before you can walk. Did you know that in episode 4 of the Hawkeye series, Clint is drinking from a mug that says Thanos was right. Which is so ironic as he lost his family to Thanos' snap. Lila, let's go! Lila? Did you know that in Hawkeye episode 4, the scene where Clint cuts Kate's wire has the same musical score as the Vormir scene in Avengers Endgame? This is because it reminded Clint of his final moments with Natasha. Thank <laughs> you.